All right, class, we got the Monday power up. It's power up B. It's for lesson 13. Start with our names. Let's check them out. Remember to say them out loud for the best results. 9 minus 8 is 1. 8 minus 5 is 3. 16 minus 9 is 7. 11 minus 9 is 2. 9 minus 3 is 6. 12 minus 4 is 8. 14 minus 9 is 5. 6 minus 4 is 2. 16 minus 8 is 8. 5 minus 2 is 3. 14 minus 7 is 7. 20 minus 10 is 10. 10 minus 7 is 3. 15 minus 6 is 9. 13 minus 7 is 6. 18 minus 9 is 9. 10 minus 8 is 2. 7 minus 3 is 4. 11 minus 5 is 6. 9 minus 4 is 5. 12 minus 6 is 6. 10 minus 5 is 5. 17 minus 9 is 8. 13 minus 8 is 5. 12 minus 3 is 9. 7 minus 2 is 5. 14 minus 8 is 6. 8 minus 6 is 2. 15 minus 7 is 8. 13 minus 9 is 4. 8 minus 4 is 4. 12 minus 5 is 7. 9 minus 2 is 7. 16 minus 7 is 9. 11 minus 8 is 3. 6 minus 3 is 3. 10 minus 6 is 4. 17 minus 8 is 9. 10 minus 10 is 0. And 11 minus 4 is 7. All right, let's check out our middle section. Remember, for full credit, you have to show all of your work on the side over here. A says 6,500 minus 500. 6,500 minus 500. 500 minus 500 is 0. Bring down, excuse me, your 6. 6,000. B. Now these are mental math. You're supposed to be able to do it in your head real quick. 20, I'm sorry, 2,000 minus 100 is like saying 20 minus 1 is 1,900. 1, 2, 3, comma, 1, 2, 3, comma, 1,900. C. Tarek purchased a one-way ticket for $225. His return ticket was the same price. How much was the round how much did the round trip cost? To get there cost him $225. To get home cost him the same, $225. 225 plus 225, 5 plus 5 is 10. Zero down, one up. Keep them all nice and straight. 2 plus 2 is 4, plus 1 is 5. And 2 plus 2 is 4. 450, do I need a label? Yes. Dollars. $450. D. Money. If the cost of one computer is $750, how much do two computers cost? $750 plus $750. 0 plus 0 is 0. 5 plus 5 is 10. 0 down, 1 up. 7 plus 7 is 14. Plus 1 is 15. 1, 2, 3, comma. Do I need a label? Yes. Dollar sign. $1,500. Halfway. E. Subtract. We have 360 minus 200. That's really like saying 3 minus 2. Pretty easy. 0 minus 0 is 0. 6 minus 0 is 6. And 3 minus 2 is 1. 160. Hopefully if you're saying it out loud, you're getting faster and faster on your addition and subtraction. F, 425 minus 125. 25 minus 25 is 0. 4 minus 1 is 3. 300. G. We have 50 plus 50 equals 100. Then we're going to subtract 25. It's like taking away a quarter from a dollar. Gives you 75. Cross it out, make it a 9. 10 minus 5 is 5, and 9 minus 2 is 7. G. 75. Take a look at H. Number sense. 8 plus 8 is 16. Minus 1 is 15, plus 5 is 20, minus 2 is 18. Problem solving problem of the day. Copy this addition problem and fill in the digits. We got some missing digits. 300 and something 4 plus 230 something equals 
something zero three. Now you're saying to yourself, or at least I'm saying to myself, four plus some number is three. Wait a minute, four minus one is three, but this is an addition problem. So we must have not a three, we must have like a 13. So let's have the regrouper up here and the answer is 13. So four plus some number equals 13. Four plus what equals 13? Four plus nine equals 13. Three down, one up. One plus something plus three equals zero. Not really zero, it's gotta be a 10. So we'll put the one up there. One plus six is seven plus three more is 10. Zero down, carry the one. 3 plus 2 plus 1 is 6. And so we have these missing numbers filled in. Box it up. Alright, we went for an A plus. We're almost there. We need to push, flip our paper over here and divide it into sections for tomorrow's assignment. Let's divide it into six sections. One vertical, two horizontal. We got examples 1 through 4 on the top and some places for the lesson problems on the bottom. Full credit, front and back, is necessary. All right, guys, happy Monday. We'll catch you on the next one.